Yeah, it's extremely concerning. It's video that's sure to make your blood boil. A 78-year-old woman assaulted by a man more than half her age. Based on information we have at this time, it does not appear as though they know one another. Sergeant Chris Burley of the Portland Police Bureau says it happened Wednesday evening near Northeast 8th and Broadway. Watch as the suspect shoves the woman so hard she falls and slams her face into a parked car. To hear of somebody in our community that's doing a, a you know, a, a stranger, a attack on someone else. It definitely poses a risk to, to other members in the community and we want members to be safe. Which is why officers wanted to catch the guy, and they did, less than a mile away. 25-year-old Justin Ames's arrest was his sixth since mid-March and his eighth since the start of the year. Some of those arrests coming after unprovoked attacks on a mall security guard and a mom pushing a stroller, but that's not all. We have a report of him causing about $700 in damage to a window of a business in a parked vehicle in uh, northwest Portland. Certainly nothing to laugh at. But it pales in comparison to what Ames is accused of doing to a woman more than 50 years his senior. We have a, an elderly person uh, that is uh, shoved and hurt uh, for no reason. Uh, nobody should be treated like that, obviously. We wanted to know why Ames was released after all those arrests over the last month or so. The Multnomah County Department of Community Justice released this statement saying, Public safety is our top priority when the individual was booked on less serious charges based on the information available and release criteria. He was not held when he was booked on more serious charges. He was held and speaking of that more serious charge, Ames is currently being held on a felony assault to charge bail has been set at a quarter million dollars.